everybody, welcome back to more Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix bonus videos. Today, we're going to take on the Hades Paradox Cup, which is one of the last things we have to do left in the game. It's going to be 50 rounds of rather intense fighting. But we're level 99 now and have basically the best equipment in the game, so I'm not too worried about it. First off, going in, our abilities, we've got basically every ability equipped. We don't have Upper Slash equipped because I don't really use it. And Finishing Leap is better. I don't have Dodge Slash equipped because it whiffs a lot. Aerial Sweep and Aerial Vibe just aren't as good as Aerial Spiral. I don't have any of the autos equipped because I don't like it overriding real reaction commands. I don't have the combo pluses equipped because I want to get to my finishers pretty quickly. I don't have negative combo equipped because I do want my combos to be at least decently long enough so my combo boosts will deal a lot more damage. I will not have Berserk Charge equipped, although the plus two strength during MP recharge will be nice. Again, I don't want to sacrifice my finishers like Explosion when I'm recharging my MP. I also don't have Magic Lock on equipped because I don't like it. I don't like how when you use Magna Guy, it'll just hover over the nearest enemy instead of over where you are. And obviously I don't have no experience equipped because that doesn't do anything now that I'm level 99. Donald, I'm gonna unequip Fantasia from because it's just not as good as Flare Force is. Uh, for Goofy, yeah, all that looks pretty good. And then Orin doesn't even matter. Just making sure my customization is right. Yes, I have Eivers, Magnagas, Kiraga, and Refliga. Hey, Hades. Welcome to the Hades Paradox Cup. All right, let's try it out. So how the Hades Paradox Cup goes is that the rules can change during that. So at the beginning, there shouldn't be any real rules. All right, and then do high combos for a lot of damage. Take that, Cyclone. Take that. And we've got the ultimate weapon on our side, so we should be making pretty quick work of these guys. Nice job, Donald. Although now you're out of MP. Well, that did a fat like nothing. Nice job, Donald. Way to show everyone you're not useless. Ooh boy, rabbit dogs and then uh, freaking plants. This should be pretty easy. Admittedly, the beginning of. Oh, it's the Fire Lord again. guy from our first visit to Agrabah. He takes a while, but he's a pretty easy fight. Too bad. Fight in the dark? I don't want to fight in the dark. Nah, just kidding. Fighting in the dark ain't that big of a deal, especially when you got the Magnaga powers. Oh, hey, bros. Nice, Donald. Enter double score mode, not that that really matters at all. I ain't trying to get the best post score. 
Oh wow, that guy has... The common enemy has two whole bars of HP all to himself. Actually, more than two bars. Holy cow. You can see just how much damage we're dealing, though. It's insane. It's over. Yeah. It's over. Back off. Man, Donald, you are just always dead, aren't you? Oh boy, we get to fight Tifa and Yuffie. Tifa doesn't stagger from damage, really, easily, so that can be tricky. Thankfully, you got Ruffle Guy. Oh, Tifa's dead. And so is Yuffie. <laughs> Bye! Gets around 20 with Titan Cup rules, so that means summons. Yeah, so after the first 10 rounds, rules switch from no rules to Titan Cup rules, so now we're alone. Give me strength. Gather. This is it. Well, why would I not summon Stitch every time? <laughs> Oh man, <laughs> it's just so broken. Give me strength. Gather. This is it. This is it. Hey Stitch, how about giving me my MP back? That would be pretty nice. Back off. Back off. Or just do nothing. Sure, why not? All right, for this fight, I'm gonna summon me a Peter Pan. It will help me take out this guy faster. Goodbye, Blizzard Lord. Thanks, Peter Pan. Like, come on, I went through the cavern of remembrance. We don't even get the core monsters in this cup. Granted, the Hades Cup was probably like the toughest challenge to do in the original Kingdom Hearts. This this cup was still in Kingdom Hearts original release. It was not added specifically to Final Mix. Oh boy, Pete. Oh, you're out of your feet, Pete. Even in the Hades Cup, Pete is like a joke. Get 
Basically, it's like, <laughs> wait for him to stop being invincible, combo him, he becomes invincible, rinse and repeat. Like, he literally can't do an attack. Although, well, dang, he has a move that just makes him completely invincible on command. That's pretty impressive. Oh, there we go. He actually attacked, and then we immediately broke him out of it. He's, like, disgusting. Alright, and then she's gonna come off. <laughs> yeah, Pete, you are just a laughably easy boss in every single time we fight you. Alright, Pain and Panic Cup rules. So now, limits are cheaper to use, but we can't use our Dry Gauge at all. Oh, that's alright. Everywhere we go, it's Donald's player for us. Nice one, Donald. I haven't even had to use any Efers yet. <laughs> oh no, not the Shaman. Get stupid Shaman out of here. Oh, bulky vendors. Okay, well, um, there's literally no reason to keep them alive if you don't care about the score. Which I don't. The better the capsule, the more uh, score orbs they'll drop. But other than that, there's literally no reason to keep them alive. Oh, hey, it's Cloud and Tifa. This'll be harder than you, and Tifa. Oh, wow. Donald's like, you gotta help me, Sora! I always die! <laughs> Let's duck flare these two. You can't hurt me while I'm using a limit cloud. <laughs> He's like, stupid fireworks! <laughs> this is, honestly, if memory serves, there's really only one round. And the Hades Cup is actually, like, pretty tough. And it's not even the final round, it's like the second to last round. Take that. <laughs> Don't mess with Sora and his Refliga. Uh, okay, I was trying to cure. But apparently Sora was like, nope. Gabber. Match one? Uh-uh. I'm not starting over from match one. I'm starting over from match, like, 20. Yeah, start from round 21. There we go. This resets our score, but we get a checkpoint every 10 levels, so it's not too bad at all.
Get out of here, fortune teller. I guess one other reason you could leave the bulky vendors alive is if you want to go for NP recharge. As you can see, we can kind of just wait it out for my meter to bump up all the way to full, and then we can end the battle. Prime Caps. Prime Caps does give you a lot of points. Alright, let's try this here. Take that, Cloud. You're not such a much. Alright, I can't believe I died to these guys. Actually, maybe it's the guys after me. Either way, dying to common enemies in the Hades Cup, that's kind of embarrassing. Oh no, it was these guys. That's even worse. Oh, night walkers, really? I think I'm scared of these guys. Because <laughs> I ain't. Goofy's just doing a ballet dance. Donald. Shamans are some of the most annoying common enemies you face in the whole game. I'm just gonna say it. And Silver Rocks, keep up, keep it up with your reaction commands. Holy cow! Oh boy. Oh, we got some nobodies here. Let's take out them snipers first. Donald, you got a little HP back for this next battle. Oh, it's Hades! We're already at the Hades fight. Taste of what's to come. Yeah. 
He's like, not, how many times can you do that double to fight off the cash? A lot, Hades, a lot. Yeah, look at how insane Replica is. <laughs> Hades, you really need to be better if you want to be the final boss of your own cup. Oh, Cerberus Cup rules. Oh, sweet. Time to go final form. Oh, man, but I don't have final form Pyraga. Ah, uh, well. Final form is still insanely powerful. <laughs> What are Demix's water clones doing in this battle? Yeah, take that. Oh, we're on a time limit now to get to the next round. Oh no. No, I I hate sorcerers. Take that. Take that, yeah. <laughs> what you gonna do about it? Oh boy, rapid thruster swarm. Final form is just absolutely insane. But you already knew that, didn't you? Wow, my drive gauge went all the way to full in like no time. And here's a fight that we actually do have to kill them all because we can't let the time run out. <laughs> This is where, uh, Magnaga comes in handy. There are more rapid thrusters literally spawning out of nowhere, and I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, take that. <laughs> that took longer than expected. Oh, fun. Um, eat my mag to go. <laughs> Okay, I don't like how Magnigo works in Final Form. We don't get actually any time to, like, use it. Like, we pull them all in, but by the time we can actually do stuff, the Magnet works off. I don't fear Berserker. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, oh man, Final Form is so fun. I don't know. Gather. Oh, no, I don't think so. Oh man, that was fun. Aerial final forms. Oh, hi, you two. I'm gonna go limit for for this fight. Oh yeah. Oh, if only I could strike right Oh, I think. Oh, but Leon's knocked out now. Okay, sweet. Aw, oh, yeah. You can't beat Limit Form. Alright, last ten rounds. It looks like we are on our own. No Donald, no Goofy, and no special rules. Yeah, this is where things start getting tough. This is where Raffle got becomes your best friend, if it wasn't already your best friend. It's over. Take that. Does takes them all out though. Man, what's with all these Lion King enemies that we're facing? I also love how Repliga is like the cheapest magic spell to use. again. 
It's not actually a thousand heartless, but same enemies. Got the armored knights and the uh, security robots. Snag him. <laughs> it's convenient, by the way, that you don't get the Goldwing Keyblade until after you fight the battle with Thousand Heartless, because imagine being able to have all the experience boosts for that battle. It would be insane. Actually, maybe this is a Thousand Heartless. Oh my gosh, look at how many enemies are getting pulled into that magnet gun. It's insane. Oh, I just had to survive. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Replica saved my life. But I had Ruffleg up. All right, fine. Starting from round forty-one. Man, I was really close to the end too. These enemies are really annoying. <laughs> They're powerful. They can like kind of stun lock you in place, and they have an insane amount of HP for common enemies. I know some people prefer to have Decisive Pumpkin as their main keyblade, but I, I like Ultima Weapon better. It doesn't deal quite as much damage for ground combos, but its explosions are more powerful. Well, actually, that might not be true. But it gives you your MP uh, bar back faster. I am all about that. I love how we can literally just attack these large bodies in their front and still damage them. Like, it's not quite as powerful. But it still does an incredible amount of damage, thanks to Guard Break. Alright, I'm in a better spot than I was last time I was here. Let's just try getting some reflex off on them. Cool, killed the Devastator, and now we just have the Hot Rods. Booyah! Refuga is insane. Alright. Four matches left. First one is just Bulky Vendor. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> now we get more enemies. Check out the living bone first. Oh, hi, Assault Riders. Oh, well, great. Morning stars. And crescendos. Actually, crescendos really aren't that bad. I also think their names got changed in Kingdom Hearts 2. Whatever. Oh, sweet. I killed everyone for the finishing move, I guess. Hi, Cerberus! I'll just heal myself. Alright, last three rounds. So the first, the quarterfinal round is Cerberus. If you fought Cerberus before, he probably won't be that. that he probably won't be that difficult. Splash is not a very good finisher for these kinds of fights. <laughs> oh well. I'm trying to save my drive forms for the next fight. The final fight is really easy, but the second to final fight is the hardest one in the cup by far. Oh man. We're gonna need I'm gonna I want all of my drive gauge for that fight, just in case. It's Take this. Take this. This is it. 
Were those heads biting each other? Good teamwork. Ouch. Bad dog. This is just a slow fight. Yeah, it's just like a slow fight, because Cerberus just keeps like running away from me. While doing very little to actual attack. I'm gonna preemptively heal here, because I would love to have full MP and HP for the next fight. That's what they were trying to do. Oh, well, I can reaction command. Just mash triangle. <laughs> the thing about the reaction commands is, like, if you just mash triangle, you're gonna get out of it. Oh, bye, Cerberus. All right, time for the real kicker. We have to fight Cloud, Tifa, Leon, and Yuffie all at the same time. By ourselves. All right, well. Let's try reflecting if I could get on the ground. Save me living for him. All right, I killed one of them. Oh, I think I killed Tifa. That's great. She's probably the most dangerous one. Then Cloud. Hi, Cloud. But somehow still alive. Even though Cloud, I should have killed. I guess he during his DM, he can't kill him. All right, sweet. Final round is super easy. It's Hades again, but this time we've got Hercules to help us. It's basically just Hades, the, the Hades fight at the end of the second visit to Olympus, but like he has more. HP. Other than that, it's exactly the same. I don't want to head attack Hades or a spear unless he turns it into it. Okay, that's where you need to use Aura Spear. Hey Hades, take that! <laughs> Get it? Because you always say take that. Alright, at least Hades is the final boss of his actual cup this time, and not like in the first game where it's like the final boss of the Hades cup is the Rock Titan, who is like the easiest fight in the entire freaking game. Thanks, Herc. <laughs> Oh, I forgot he made, like, the fireball. No, that's fine. You don't even have to go in the center. You'd think Hades would be a little more powerful if he's the final boss of the Hades Cup, which is level 99 battle, uh, battle level. Bye, Hades! And that's the Hades Cup, and we get... the Hades Cup Trophy! <laughs> Hades, you lost your own cup. He's like, I can't believe this happened again. And then Pegasus kicks him away. What? We did it. <laughs> and Sora's like, man, I can't wait to put this in my room. And we get the Hades Cup trophy. Trophy presented to the champion of the Hades Paradox Cup. It is proof of having won many severe battles. But that's all we get. We don't actually get anything like practical for it, like a new Keyblade or a new armor or anything. Nope, just a one-off item that's saying, hey, we beat the Hades Cup. Were pretty cool. Anyhow, there's like a uh, PS4 tro actual like trophies like outside of the game that you can get by getting a high score in a lot of the Olympus Coliseum cups. As you can see, if we go to like the journal, go under missions for Olympus Coliseum, 
Oh yeah, we can do Phil's training again if we want. As you can see, it's like, okay, win the Pain and Panic Cup with 2,000 or more score. Win Cerberus Cup with 1,000 or more score. Win Titan Cup with 5,000 or more. We have the only one we actually got the best score for was the Pain and Panic Paradox Cup. Oof. That's not great. Anyhow, that's it for this episode of Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix, everyone. Thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Already. Tune in next time. Remember all those random Organization 14 mushrooms that we've been seeing? Well... We're going to complete all of their challenges next time. Some of them are really easy. Some of them are hair-pullingly difficult. So, look forward to that next time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.